Hey losers, Zero X here. Welcome back to another episode of the Skyblock Control API, whatever. Um, I'm mad because I recorded this whole thing and I even uploaded it and the audio wasn't working. So now I'm going to go over everything I did. Uh, before, if you didn't see the last episode, we did like bizarre stuff with like buy orders and like we're trying to figure out the, how much economy is being traded every hour or so on the uh, on Skyblock. And to do that, we want rock coin, but we don't care about items being traded. We care about like rock coin being traded. Um, so last episode, we did like bizarre buy orders, and I already did, I'm not gonna recode uh, for like a tenth time. And so what's actually gonna happen is I'm just gonna show you what I did. Okay. Uh, so very simply, you're gonna see some new functions. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you what it does first. Um, so before I show you what it does, what do you think are the three most uh, expensive items on the bazaar? What do you think are the three highest value economy, like overall economy wise, uh, of for buy orders in the bazaar? Go ahead, comment down below. No one did a last video. Fuck you guys. Uh, if you're here, I'm saying at the start of the video, so you fucking do it. Um, I'm gonna run this, and you'll see. Uh, it's fancy. It's readable. Uh, the amount of money that was traded at auctions in the last 60 seconds is about 1.8 bill. Kind of interesting. It's about 68.8 bill uh, currently on in buy orders on the bazaar and reasonable buy orders. Now we are using, uh, if you guys remember last time, we did set up, where is it? This? Threshold, we're using threshold too. A um, few things that we set up. So we set up auctions and an endpoint. I'm not gonna go over how it works. If you really care about this, Comment in the description if you really want me to make a video specifically on auctions. I'll make like a side video on auctions ended. It's not a big endpoint. Uh, so I just made that, uh, which is just swapping out the word bizarre and then different way. The reason why I did that is because then we in here, instead of just printing out the items to make it all fancy like I did, uh, what we did is we actually added it to a list here. And we pass that list, or I'll keep that open. We pass that list into this function that we call down here right before returning. Uh, we call this function, uh, which just sorts them uh, highest to lowest, so a reverse sort, I guess. And then it prints them. I add some padding, so I'll show you guys why this this line right here, what it does is, uh, if I turn this back on, you see, you see whoa, let's fix this there we go why was it like that that was weird um so you see this how there's like spacing here so this spacing it can take up to 30 characters this is exactly 30 characters uh, and that just it works so that means that this is all gonna be lined up this item is not actually on the bazaar and this item i don't think it's actually on the bazaar or just not traded enough i think they're just not on the bazaar though uh, bizarre cookie here. You might be thinking, oh, I know what a bizarre cookie. No, you don't, because bizarre cookie is actually under a different name all the way up here. Where is it going to be? Uh, Boost cookie. It's actually rank one right now. Wow. Oh my God. Someone, someone dumped a lot of money in Boost cookie. This was at like three bill yesterday when I made this video, uh, for the first time when the audio broke, and now it's at 8.7 bill. Jesus Christ. Someone is trying to, a lot of people are trying to, and there's no way someone put up six bill boosters. Someone's trying to buy a lot of booster cookies. Uh, and then Shanty Gold Blocks is at like four bill last night. Someone, uh, they it was at 2.8 bill. And then mid video, someone put up 1.2 bill of buy orders and then took it down after, I think, um, or it filled or something. I don't know. Uh, anyway, that's back down to 2.8 bill. Uh, stuff like this and so using this we're going to like track inflation stuff which is pretty cool of like individual items i think that's interesting i'm uh, more interested in this because every 60 seconds like 1.8 bill shared on the auction house i'll show you guys how we did that now uh so i'm gonna go ahead and hide this again um so do, what we did is we used our get auctions ended here and then we fed that into this and it's literally like five lines to four lines of code, super quick. All it does is it goes through every item, every auction object, and it just gets the sale price. Um, so whether it's been or not, doesn't matter. It, there'll always be a price tag. And these are items that are confirmed to have sold in the past six seconds. And so we can just take that price tag, add them up, uh, take all the price tags, add them all up. And uh, there we go. We've got our uh, our sum, and then what we do is we just call this function down here and in here, and also to format with the the commas so it's readable. What you do is just right before the the thing after the variable. Um, so let's say you had like 
uh, this, where it's like a five, uh, or let's say you have like this number, okay, and you want to sort, uh, you want to add the commas automatically. So what you do is you just do colon and then comma like that, and colon comma like this. It'll just add the uh, commas every three digits, basically. It's super simple and it always works. Very consistent. I like it. A lot more consistent than what I was using uh, before if you've watched some of my live streams uh, where we use like a function to do it and it's a bit disgusting, you know. Um, but yeah, that's, I mean, short video, but I'm I'm so mad that the other didn't work. Uh, what we're going to do next episode, because uh, we did our toys into a bit, auctions a bit today, we're going to be finishing auctions hopefully next episode. If not, we're going to be doing like half and then we'll push it back for another fourth episode of this mini series. Uh, that said, after the series, I don't know what to do. So uh, make sure you join the Discord down in the description below and suggest stuff. If you actively watch the series, uh, and you go ahead and suggest something, chances are you're one of at most three people who's going to suggest something. Uh, and you know what that means? That means I'm going to very high, very high chance that I'm going to do it. Very likely that I'm going to take your suggestion and do it. So if you want something, uh, go suggest it and I'll make it. Uh, most likely. Um, anyways, make sure you like the video if, I mean, just whatever. And then comment something stupid like your favorite type of sushi uh and if you don't eat sushi then i don't know if your favorite pizza topping tell me what you order when you order pizza anyways i've got nothing left for i've got nothing left for you i'll see you guys next time peace